of sure after. Hello there guys, what is going on? This is the Inside HD and today I'm going to be talking to you guys. First of all, welcome back to the GTA 5 chat show. And uh, today I'm going to be talking to you guys about two ideas and rumours in um, GTA 5 community, which is um, housing development and, of course, um, yeah, housing development and something that I thought of called the prison system. Okay, so uh, basically, what uh, what the prison system, we'll start off with the prison system first, alright? Picture this. Um, this idea came to me uh, partly because I watched Ollie43's idea about this, and purely because I was watching Prison Break at the time. Um, but, just picture this, okay? You're getting a guard chase, or getting a cop chase, as Franklin say. You get arrested, right? And you sneak in, like, contraband or something, yeah? Like, to contact, uh, say, Trevor. Right, who's in the helicopter? He comes in, right, blows the shit out of a wall, and takes you out of prison, and you escape. And then everyone's asked you, like, and you have to do certain things, and you can pay people off, and br sorry, and you can like bribe people, um, and all that stuff. Now, I think that'd be pretty cool, um, generally, like, and you have to like sim the days when you're in prison. I just think that'd be really fun. Um, it make the game a whole lot more realistic. But of course, we don't want this game too realistic. We want it to be fun. Um, but I think that'd be a really cool addition to the game. Um, oh my god. And, uh, the second thing I want to talk about is, of course, housing development and, uh, property. Now, we all know in Grand Theft Auto, um, that people like to, like, own territory and own land. Now, mainly, you see this in the Saints Row games, like Saints Row 2, Saints Row 3. Um, we take over territory of, like, the islands and all that, and the more islands you get, like, the cheaper discounts you get and stuff. Now I think this would be good for the fact that you could get, I uh, just picture this, like, say, as gang war going down in Los Santos, right, uh, like, say, seven Los Santos, and you, like, sort of stop it, like, you stop the, the oh my god, the gang war from, like, happening, right, uh, say that happens, you stop the gang war from happening, you're on your own, and, uh, so basically everyone in that part of Los Santos sort of looks up to you, and they're like, oh, this is the guy that helped us and all that, and you get discounts, um, the people help you, like, say, if you're running away from the police, and the police would ask somebody, I don't know if the game's going to be this realistic, but say the police ask somebody, they're like, have you seen this man running anywhere? They'd, like, help you out and say, no, I haven't seen him or anything, but I think that'd be a really cool addition to the game. Um, it'd just be really fun to add overall, and uh, housing development, I think it'd be really cool as well to bring back the feature they had in previous GTA games, of building, like, not building houses, like, owning houses, like, owning your own property, now, um, obviously this would be a really fun feature to have in Grand Theft Auto, as we will probably know by now. Um, but I think it'd be really fun, like, if you build up enough money, you can buy your house instead of getting houses for completing missions. Because let's be honest, if they want to make this the best GTA game yet, and they want to make it as most realistic as possible, people aren't going to give you a house for going and killing somebody. Like in GTA IV, Playboy gives you a house for doing missions with him. Th he wouldn't give you that. He wouldn't give you that penthouse for doing, like, 17 missions with him. Um, you have to make it realistic, like, you have to build up enough money, like, in your bank accounts and stuff, and your ATMs, just to buy the house and, like, pay rent and stuff, maybe not pay rent, that's a bit too much, but it's, like, just to buy the house in general, then you have to build up your money again, um, I think that would be a really cool feature to the game, and, uh, I think it would make the game really, a lot more interesting, it kind of make it, like, a day-to-day -day lifestyle game, like, you come on, you'd be like, oh, yeah, uh, I'm saving up for this house, um, on Grand Theft Auto or something, uh, Obviously, if you're that sad, you're not going to go out. You're going to stay on GTA with your friends. I know I will for the first few, probably the week. But uh, after that, I'll go out. Um, but anyway, guys, um, it should be really cool. So it's the prison system and housing development and uh, property. Now, if you guys want to hear anything else on what I have to say about Grand Theft Auto V and my ideas on the game, please hit me with an inbox or hit me down in the comments below. Anyway, guys, thank you for your time. Thank you for watching this video. I have been the Insight HD. And I'll see you later, guys. Peace out.